Hi guys, so welcome to a new video. Today's video is my Centre Parks vlog part two. So if you haven't already seen part one, I'll just leave it linked up here. So go watch that one and then come back and watch this one. It's just Centre Parks at Elfton Forest. I'm doing it in two parts. So I'm doing this intro now. This is like weeks and weeks later and I've just been editing and realised that I need to do it in two parts. I think in the next clip you're going to see us heading to the climbing centre so my brother and his girlfriend are going to go climbing and I didn't explain that in the vlog I just videoed us going there so yeah that is what we're doing if you wondered so yeah if you do like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you're not already hit that subscribe button down below I'd love to have you here and yeah if you want to see what we got up to in my part two centre parks vlogs then just keep on watching So this morning we're going to go watch Rick and Becca climb, so it should be fun. And this is the sports plaza, it's very quiet at this time in the morning and that looks fun. They're just over here getting harnessed up, but yeah they look really good. I'm good, I'm not actually doing it. Are you shouting at Auntie Becca? No, doing a double. I stacked it. Maisie wants to uh, go climb too. Hey Maisie, you want him to go for a climb? Nice place to have um, a Starbucks. I've got a peached iced tea. And yeah, this up. How nice. Here is the pecan caramel salted swirl thingy. So we're about to go on the electric boats. Lewis hasn't come with us because he's having Maisie. She's just down for a nap and he's not really into the like boaty type things. So yeah, we managed to get her down for a nap, which is good. Just means she can come swimming with us later because Lewis wants to come swimming now. So unfortunately, we actually didn't get to do the boat because apparently on booking in and out days, the lake's not open in the afternoon. So they're not quite sure why we were able to book it but actually the guy that we spoke to was amazing he got us a complete refund on the activity and then they've rebooked us for a different day uh, for it and also gave us a round of adventure gold so I insert that footage here so yeah really good customer service even though they uh, messed it up a little bit but yeah I'm very out of breath because I'm all trying to walk really fast to get back for the baby to get her changed so we can go swimming which is in like 10 minutes so yeah uh, I'm in a rush <laughs> Okay, so Lewis and I are here in the sports plaza and we're going to play football pool. Now I've been told by him I've got to read the rules apparently. Oh, if you're wondering why I've got so much makeup on, we're going to the bar afterwards, so Nana's got baby. <laughs> we're playing classic. That's wonky. It's wonky. So I did part, but part of the white. 
Okay, so we are 2-2, two -two, playing best of five. Stop the video and comment who you think's gonna win. I think I'm gonna win because I just totally had Lewis's pants down on that last game. Lewis, who won? Who won? Who won? Some of them games were Wait, no, 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 who won? Who won? <laughs> so it literally just came down to me and Lewis just having Lewis had the black, just the black and I had two to go so I have my colour and the black and I won three, two Lewis hasn't won anything all holiday have you? Have you won anything all holiday? He's not won anything all holiday Best day ever Hey guys, so I haven't spoken to you all day today. I've just been really busy and I actually slept in because I was absolutely just knackered. But today, me and Rick went swimming. It was just me and him because they're going home tomorrow because Becca starts a new job on Monday so she needs to get home. So yeah, me and Rick went swimming. It was really, really busy today. So today is a Saturday. So yeah, that is just something to note that it's a bit busy at weekends. I also went on the aqua park thing. I'll insert some footage here. The uh, wetsuit is not the most flattering of things, but you know. <laughs> We're just heading off to the Italian for some dinner. It's our second to last night, so yeah. Tomorrow we're gonna have a takeaway again. So I'll catch you when we're there. Look at your little outfit. Cute little dress. I'm in a cute little dress. Amazing. What are you doing? <laughs> I will have to strap you in. Yeah. We're just waiting for your starter, aren't we? Oh, yeah. Maisie's first experience on sands. There's some little ducks. Maisie, what do ducks say? What do ducks say, Maisie? No, she don't like it, look. Oh, you don't like it, Moo? <laughs> she loves it, these birds, Moo. That one's as big as she is. <laughs> How close this one is. Look at the smoke coming off the river. Why are these geese all stood on one leg? <laughs> Looking cool. <laughs> so looking extra cool this morning, we're about to do the aerial adventure and I'm very excited for it. So Luz is going to hopefully get as much footage as they can on it. Um, we've got a zip wire at the end, so I'm very, very, very excited.
on my phone for now, but I thought I'd just get a little bit of footage of Maisie in the pool. Are you having fun? Should we go around the Lazy River, Moo? What's Pops doing to your hair? Oh, what is Pops doing to your hair? <laughs> <laughs> Come on then, shall we go around the lazy river? Don't get told off for taking my phone. Yeah. Let me get in front. Yeah, baby! <laughs> Where are we going? <laughs> Yay! So this is the Lazy River and she absolutely loves coming round here. Don't you Moo? So this is where we're going. Yay Maisie! Oh that little face. Are you going off for that, Mummy? Wow! Hello, <laughs> Are you there now? Is that favourite today? Is this your favourite Yeah! Oh, look at her little face. So we're on one of the electric boats. Mace has joined us. And Daddy? Oh, now Mum's gonna stay. I enjoyed it. Very nervous about the baby being on the boat. I don't want it to go climbing off. But she's just chilling at the moment with her cutest little life jacket on. Hey, Mum's staring. Her gammy arm. Dad chilling. I've been able to do all week. Yeah. Relax, Can relax, Mum. What you tied to there, G? The emergency cut off switch. Oh, right. Okay, so we've just got back from the boat. I don't know. We said we would pay. I'm going to leave that in. No, I'm going to interrupt your vlog every time. Why? You're wrong. No. Yes. No. Yes. You've been a trap. Well, you can't put that on YouTube now. You just swore. You can. I squeal. So, yeah, I don't think that we would do the boat again. We all kind of said that. It was a bit boring and with a baby and with a baby as well it just wasn't that enjoyable because she got really bored of it so yeah Maisie Maisie what are you doing and we've just ordered a Chinese so we are just waiting for the Chinese to arrive I'm gonna leave Lewis in trying to ruin the vlog and I'm going to leave that in as well, so everyone knows what an idiot he's being. Our lodge was Maple 770, and honestly, if you are coming and you are getting to choose your villa or lodge, this is a pretty good location. We're like a two minute bike ride away and literally a five minute walk from the centre. So yeah, this is what it looks like. This is all ours. It's down like that. I do apologise for the mess, mother. One second. I'm just showing everyone the uh, Look at this. the lodge. What, where now it's all filthy? You should have done it when it was clean. I know. So, they've all got en suites. That's the kids' room. 
the double uh, twin and then in here it's like there's loads of space in here actually probably could have put the pram in here but yeah iron uh, that is just I don't know what that is oh the water tank yeah and then a little entrance hall where we've just popped the pram it is a bit messy because we're going home tomorrow so uh, nice big living area kitchen Maisie and Daddy. Um, this has fit all six adults in comfortably. Uh, we got this on the board. This is my brother and Becca's room. They've already gone because Becca's had to go. Here is just storage. The storage is pretty good. Again, on suite because we have the new style executive lodge. Oh, and that's their view. Nice. Oh, daddy and then this is our outside area. Did come with a high chair as well. Um, barbecue, an outdoor shower. We haven't used this. I think Lewis had one little go in it. Um, and then we do have a sauna, but again, we haven't actually used this. Uh, we didn't book it for the sauna, we just booked it because we wanted a bigger lodge. And then this is our view from the back. The others have seen a deer, I'm really sad that I haven't. And then obviously there's like just other um, lodges. But it's been really quiet. Oh, there is a fire and a TV and a moomin. Here is the kitchen. And then there's like, there's a dishwasher, a wine fridge. We bought all of this stuff with us for Maisie. Oven, fridge, that isn't massive, so just be aware of that. Toaster, kettle, microwave, um, and then you do get all like your plates and stuff. So, and then the our room again. Just sorry for the mess. Uh, it's our bed. So it would have been quite a big room, but obviously we have the cot, and we couldn't really get into any of the storage because of Maisie. But yeah, this comes with the lodge, and it is really, really, really sturdy. There's just ours just backs onto there, and then the reason we had this room is because we wanted the bath for Maisie. And we did end up bringing her bath chair, but I just got in the bath with her. So yeah, that's all our stuff on there. And me. So yeah, that's the lodge. And they've all got nice little murals everywhere. Oh, look, baby. <sighs> Guys, it is a couple of weeks later after the Centre Parks trip. I'm talking quite quietly because Maisie is asleep and if you do hear some background noise, it's just the dishwasher. I didn't actually film leaving, I don't think, because it's just, you know, getting all the car ready and all of Maisie's stuff back together and then actually getting home. So the journey home was really easy. Yeah, the car journey back was a thousand times better than the journey there because that journey was absolutely horrendous. Me and Lewis have driven to Norfolk a thousand times and that was literally the worst one, which is sod's law, which is the first time on long car journey with the baby. Just sort of give a recap of the whole trip. We absolutely loved it, like every single minute of it. We've never done it before and we really loved it. I thought it was great for families and just some tips when you're with children, the baby change facilities are great, so don't worry about those. We did take all of her stuff, like her prep machine for her bottles, and you do need a cot sheet, so do make sure that you take one of those, if I haven't mentioned it already, if you're putting them in the cot. We also took our monitor so that we could see her in the room, and the Wi-Fi was completely fine, it supported it, so that was fine. We were glad that we had the ensuite rooms as well. So if you can, it is better to get, in my opinion, the executive lodge if there's six adults sharing, because I can't imagine just sharing one bathroom. We also paid extra to pick where our lodge was. Again, if you have kids, I would recommend it because we wanted to be close to amenities. So if we were out and she needed to get back, then we weren't too far. Or if 
we were going for food and she was having a nap it meant that we could get her up quite quickly and over to the restaurant i would also say if you do have a young baby like we did maybe don't do quite as many activities i was knackered by the end and lewis didn't do as many because he's not as into that kind of stuff as i am and so even with him looking after her I would say just pick and choose and I'd probably say that if we went again I wouldn't do quite as many activities I might do some more of the relaxing ones like the spa and stuff the Italian food was hands down the best the service was great the food was great the kids menu was great so yeah really highly recommend there Hooks bar and grill I really enjoyed it but some people said that their food wasn't great but I really enjoyed it and again the staff are great I think that's one of the main things about centre parts is the staff are fantastic I know it can be expensive but I feel that you really get what you pay for. The facilities for the kids in the swimming pool are brilliant so the changing rooms are really well equipped for families. The lodges are well equipped for families, they've all got like curved edges so if you've got a little one like we did you're not going to be worried about them like cracking their heads on like sharp edged things and stuff obviously you still have to watch them all in all we are definitely going to go again i think we might try the one closest to us which is actually sherwood we went to elfdom because lewis's dad lives in norfolk and that's in suffolk so yeah it was quite close to him and we could get to go see him and take the baby and that kind of stuff i think yeah we definitely want to go again i'd love to go around christmas not this christmas obviously but yeah we would really love to go again and really enjoyed just everything the pool was my favorite bit and the cyclamen brother went on it like a thousand times oh, i do recommend getting one of those floaty things that we have Maisie in uh, if you've got a baby her age that can't quite swim yet i just find it a lot better than holding her so yeah again that's just a tip and i just say if you're hesitating just book it i really really loved it it was just such a nice experience and the atmosphere was great i think it's great for kids and i think for, pe for kids older than Maisie, it'll be even better so yeah if you really liked this vlog please give it a thumbs up and if you would like to see more family style vlogs and travel and things to do probably in and around the uk at the moment but hopefully at some point we will travel uh, abroad i want to sort of broaden my channel into a more of a family vlogging sort of channel and i want to do all sort of like days out and tips for kids and stuff so if that's your kind of thing don't forget to hit that subscribe button and i'll see you next one thanks guys bye